glad to say we're still undefeated in the league. We came off to a good start. I mean, obviously when we when we kept the speed in the game and uh, we were able to maintain the offensive game style, I think we managed to to play well and, and, and take control of the match. So we we're happy to come out on top. I hate losing, but it's even worse when you lose by one point in the fifth set. And you know, when you're so close and you really feel like you can win, it's it's frustrating. And it's you know, I feel I feel bad for my team because it's it's we could have got that win, win and we really could get this next one, and then we could have been a three love win. I've had a knee injury, and my movement is a little bit tentative as it is. Um, so to them fall, I was I don't even know what happened. I think I just tried to forget about it because the more you think about stuff like that the worse it does make you feel and um, there was a few times that my knee was quite sore but as soon as you know you try and focus back on the tactics then you kind of forget about that. The last two weeks getting to a final and then winning my, my first international title has given me a lot of confidence so I can play a bit freer I feel like I've got a bit of a monkey off my back it's been nice so uh, yeah I, I feel I can enjoy it a little bit more than you know now that now that I've, I've ticked that box so to say first one was quite tight. I think I was quite far down the second as well and I put a few good runs of points together and that kind of made the difference but they were good rallies and I was just as the match went on I got more confident that I was going to win most of them so it could have gone the other way if he, if he had have taken those little chances he had but yeah. Which is for the NBL as a whole we want as much crowd participation as possible and when we were in Bristol a few a few weeks back it, it was exactly the same the crowd were fantastic and when you get that player crowd interaction it, it makes the game so much better and people can embrace the game of badminton a lot more. I'm enjoying it a lot. It's very different from what I know from back from Denmark. Yeah, I think the system is great. That is uh, constantly uh, pressure on all on court. And yeah, I think the, the point system is great too. Uh, every match count and I think that's a good idea. Yeah, it was great. You know, we, we knew that was going to be a very tough game and um, we wanted to go out there and play our best. We've not played together before, so we knew it was going to be take a bit of getting used to, especially with a left-handed, right-handed combo. I've not, I've not had that my whole career, actually, so it was a bit different. I, it's so nice to be able to still play just for fun now and a bit of enjoyment. You know, it's, it's, it's really nice to, to compete and be competitive again. I think we can uh, safely say that we think it went well. We really uh, like got a good level there going. Uh, I think especially in the in the first three, like we were very sharp today and uh, yeah managed to perform well and, and beat them quite comfortably. Like I think that's a very good result. Uh, we play together normally in uh, in international tournaments. I played against Bristol last time, my first match. So it's my uh, it was my first uh, match at uh, at home. Uh, and uh, we got the first win, so it was nice.